our military base is getting penetrated by foreign nationals. Uh. Prepare to charge! Holy Jaw dropping news coming out of the US military bases up to two to three times per day. Non citizens have been trying to sneak onto military bases every single day. You won't believe this news. Chechens, Jordanians, some of them just crossed the border. What's going on? Well, you know, this thing of our military bases getting penetrated by foreign nationals uh, is happening more and more. You know, this is something we see probably two or three times a week where we're stopping these folks at the gate. Frodo. Uh, with, a week. With, yeah, a week at least. And this is just Navy alone uh, where we're seeing folks try to come in. And usually the cover story is, and uh, I'm a student, you know, I'm here, I'm an enthusiast, I want to see the ships, that type of thing. Sorry, y'all. It was an accident. Sorry. We have to turn them around. And typically we get uh, NCIS involved with those and we get biometrics when possible. But yes, there's been an uptick sorry, sorry, in that. Do they have passports? Do they have a lot of times they have they passports? Have they have papers, yes. Uh, but they're in no way, shape, or form authorized to be on our base. And it's really hard for us to tell the underlying motive for these type of cases. Wow. Uh, I'm gonna control myself right now. Uh, that's uh, that's stunning. It is. Holy. It's gotta be a concern. This is Russian, a Chinese. Uh, this comes from all all these different nations. We're seeing an uptick come. in it. Uh, in addition to that, there's been some reporting on this over the last six months. You're getting two or three drones flying over military bases in America per week. That is no question. We're having drones fly over our military bases. We're having illegals trying to sneak onto U.S. military bases. And these illegals are coming from, obviously, the border crossings that's been up like 26 million people in the last couple of years. This idea that it's just good people looking for jobs is the most is the biggest propaganda lie I've ever seen in my life. It's just incredible. Just the white coat, white label. Just give everyone that label of these are just good people looking for not people taking advantage of a system or countries that absolutely hate our guts taking advantage of the system, you know, whether justified or not. This is a huge problem. Two to three times a day, people just trying to sneak on to military bases. Oh, I just just wanted to check it out. I thought uh, I thought it was like Costco. I just show my membership and uh, you, you can just let me in. But who hasn't wanted to check out a military base if you're not part of the military? It's like, what goes on at the military? And how many aliens are they st storing at these facilities? What are your thoughts on this video? What are your thoughts on average Americans every single day also not feeling safe whatsoever? And to hear that it's even bleeding into our military bases as you have the Chinese buying up farmland and land right next to some of our most sensitive bases, also flying drones over in our military bases. Can they like track where these drones are? It's just like these weather balloons is what weather balloons that were emitting information back home where they were just calling them useless balloons. Countries are probing us. China and Taiwan are popping off. You just saw today that Israel and Egypt entered in a gunfight where one Egyptian soldier was just killed today. That war is continuing to get worse, clearly. If, if Israel is having gunfights with Egypt, things are escalating. And then we have Russia and Ukraine continue to escalate as you also continuously hear reports coming out of Russia. They're, they're thinking about nuclear. And then we have these people that are trying to penetrate our military installations every single day, pro, you know, disguising themselves as just fun tourists. We're just looking. I just want to check it out. I'm new here in America. I just crossed the border illegally, and I would love to see what's going on at some of these bases. I've seen Area 51 documentaries, and I wonder if they're all the same. <laughs> God. We are absolutely and it's a problem. Thank you so much. I'm gonna come. Say, I hope you guys have a wonderful freaking day. And if you don't mind dropping a like on this video and putting a comment below, how do you feel? about the military bases getting attempted to be penetrated every single day, multiple times a day, by illegal migrants.
You let me know. I like saying illegal migrants because it gets both people on each side of the aisle mad. Have a wonderful day. Bye.